Serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday. Oh, it's Hamburg. Okay. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a look at her. You had to see her eyes. Her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. Oh no. She looked like a corpse. Like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. <laughs> I, haven't like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. Alright, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just hey, you gotta stay strong. Okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, it'll sink to pieces. Oh. Oh, oh, come on. Uh oh. Just getting good. This is how accidents happen, no. Oh no. Oh man, this is beautiful. I mean, really beautiful. I need some sleep. Yeah, you do. Uh oh. Oh shit! I mean. Okay. Sounds to me like. That's not good. That's not good at all. Why would you do that, dude? Well, oh, game's chugging a bit. Guess I'll have to tweak the graphics a little more. What do I do? What am I gonna do? Uh oh. Oh, oh no. Hey, it's young Leon. Perfect. Poor buddy does not know what he's walking into. Oh, man. You should not be going near that city, man. I mean, you could change the timeline if you just didn't go. There he is. Lovely, lovely man. One's around. Nope. That's the first sign of anything suspicious, man. Weird. Honestly. Oh. Oh no. Oh, don't do it. Don't. Don't do it. You don't. No. Oh, okay. And this is the start of the game. <laughs> Hi there, my name's the True Neb, I'm the only me there is, and welcome back, I should say, or welcome to the official release of the Resident Evil 2 Remake. Now, whoa, that's a camera I forgot was, uh, was already here. A little sensitive. Now, before I start, let me just say the game is gorgeous, and funny story actually happened to me. I recorded the demo and then I kind of forgot about it and then it was like four days later about three days before the release of the game actually and you know what happened I realized that the game was gonna be released today <laughs> or rather the day it was supposed to release and you know if I hadn't figured it out I we well we wouldn't be here would we Leon, I love you, man, but you, you gotta not go in there. No, no, look at me when I'm talking to you, man. Okay, whatever. So, uh, another kind little thing before I actually step in here. I am going to rectify the embarrassment that was playing the demo, which, as I mentioned in that video, I'd never played Resident Evil 2 before, so I have no idea what I'm actually doing. This is my first experience with it, it looks awesome. I only know Leon thanks to Resident Evil 4, but that's a flashlight in there. But more than that, I'm going to rectify that by actually, you know, doing everything, seeing everything, getting everything, getting to the liquors at the very least, 
and so much more as we pass the game. So without uh, that said, and without further ado, let's step right in, my friend. Let's step right in. Alright, let's step in. Careful now. You do not want to encounter these guys right at the beginning. But what we do want to Hello? find... Anybody there? Is the gun. At the very least, our young knife friend. Since, as we all know, this is young Leon, years before Resident Evil 4. Right. And we also find young knife, at least in the demo we did. Oh, good lord. Man, the ambience in this game is beautiful. They really went all out with it. The young knife. Not yet with the resistance of a thousand knives, like in Resident Evil 4, where it was pretty much a knife that would last you forever. Here, it'll break off. It will always break off. I am a very curious person, so I'm just gonna look around. Oh, that's you not right? good. Are you okay, sir? Please answer. Don't move. I'll be back for you. Oh, that is never a good idea. Let's just check this out first. Run real casually. Leon, you know, just la la la, I'm just sprinting. <laughs> it's cool, it's cool. What in the world is that sound? Am I gonna have to go over there? I hope not. Or maybe. Who knows? Okay, there's nothing here. Sir, do you have a weapon on you? No? Alright, never mind. I didn't want a weapon anyway. It's too early for that. Alrighty. Man, what a way to create ambience. Creepy noises to my left. Uh, oh. Hallway, dark kind of hallway, lo lo lots of noises. Oh, and the music is amp ramping up, amping up, I don't know. Can we, there to go, there to go, all right, go. We on the boy. Stop moving. Officer, you need help. Stay back, sir. I got this. Oh, I'm sure you do, sir. Oh, I'm sure you do. Oh, Lord. Okay, it's still like a bit, but okay, okay. Ah. Perfect. Ew. Perfect slow motion with a bit of lagginess, just to Freeze. add that effect. Oh, no. Oh, you have a gun already? This is to add the effect that I'm. Oh, good. God. No! Stop it, sir. Only Leon survives getting bit. Okay, Leon. Again. Come on. I suck at this. I just played the demo. There you go. What the? There you go. And one more for safety. <laughs> Man, okay, what a start. Unlike. Oh no, he's gonna get up. Unlike the demo, I am gonna make sure to try and save bullets, and I'm not gonna be as crazy with my shooting. And that's what I said I'd do, but you know, here we are. Tight spaces, closed off, uh, no real amount of bullets. He's about to get up. Tell me you have ammo on you, man. You don't have ammo on you. Oh, this is bad. But hey, what's over here? I see a key. Some bikini posters. A key! Storage room. Oh, I get it. Oh, and the frickin' inventory, man. That's gonna be beautiful and you know it. Okay. I am not about to do this. Can we not close the door? Okay. Nope. No, we cannot. I need you to use... Yeah, okay, I got it. Use it. Hurry up. I'm glad you don't have hands for that. Sir, tell me- Oh no! Oh no! Oh, oh, oh no! Run the fuck out, man! Oh shit! Oh shit! No 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 Don't shoot! Get down! You, you don't have- You did not have any bullets left, sir. You did not have any bullets. But okay, I'll forgive you because you're Leon. You alright? Yeah, Jesus, so. that, that was terrifying. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit. No bullets and all zombies makes for a very scary game. Because it's not even about the zombies, it's just about the lack of bullets. Come on. Get in! 
Yeah, get in. Hold on. Oh, oh well, okay. We're lucky the car had gas. And we're going straight into the lion's den. I, I love it. What the hell is going on? I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, yeah I know. Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Ah, Claire, my darling. Live around here? No. Oh, you know. For my brother. He's a cop, too. Chris. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. Yeah, I mean, it's been like five minutes, but yeah, you don't know what to expect. <laughs> Who am I to say otherwise? And, and so it begins. Oh yes, I... I knew the moment I played the demo I had to play this in, in its entirety. Because, and this is something I can actually say a little uh, proudly, playing that demo made me realize it's been a really long time, about a year or so, since I've actually felt excited for a game. I think the last time I, I felt this excited to play a game was with Breath of the Wild. So seeing this is just, oh, man, the anxiousness in the last few days was, it was palpable. That, 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 that much is sure. And now we begin Resident Evil 2. It's missing the voiceover right now, but I don't care. That's my voiceover. And we are going to do things differently, and we're going to do it all beautifully Attention and all citizens. beautiful. Due to the citywide outbreak, you were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Are we going to start at the police station so soon? Will be to in need. Okay, okay. Oh my God, if we are, so then that's bad. good. The police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but... What if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. I agree. Also, your voices are not synced to your lips. I don't care. I hope you don't care either. Oh, dear lord. Oh, wait. I'm getting weird flashbacks. I also mentioned in the previous video that it's I like did play a Resident here. Evil from the PS1 era. I think it was the one that had Nemesis in it, so I think it was Code Veronica, but I cannot be sure. I can't remember. More like running. But I do sort of remember this scene. Oh. Maybe not the PS1 era though. I don't know. Leon, you gotta back up. Yeah, do it, do it. Uh, also, sink your lips, please. Oh, because it's a, it's a cutscene. Oh, hello. Okay, you are really lagging. Oh, sir. Holy shit. Here, get out. Get out now! That's not good. I have to fix the cutscenes if it's possible. Oh, I think I know how to fix it. Oh, that was close. How convenient. Or not. Wow, that, that must hurt. My forehead. Or rather, Leon's. And of course, that conveniently created a wall between all the zombies and me. Claire is obviously gone. That was extremely close. I'm gonna have to keep tweaking though. Ooh, man. You are, you are not having a good day. Now, this is how you start a bad day. Rookie cop, explosions, zombies. Claire! Claire! Are you okay? mm -mm, nope. Sorry, man. I'm alright! How about you? Sort of. Oh, this makes sense. I think there's two game here. modes. One for Claire and one for Leon, so I'll this makes sense. Station. She starts there, I'll I start there. here. I don't have the the bullets. I don't have the bullets, no. You gotta run, man. You don't have the bullets. Excuse you! Okay, let's just run. Man, this is pretty. You don't want to touch that guy. He's he's not cool. Oh no! Can I even? I can't squeeze through there, can I? No, no. Get out, sir. Get out. I don't want it. I don't want it. 
I wonder if there's anything I can miss in these parts. I don't think so. Shit. It's everybody. They've all turned. Into? Why don't people in these games ever know what a zombie are? I mean, I know why, but... There it is. The station. The station. Okay, pretty soon. That's awesome. That's very awesome. Ah, oh, I can't believe this. Come on. Buddy, I don't want any of that. Nope, not you. Get out. No, 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 no. None of that. Oh, that was lucky. Only you could always run. What about Claire? Just want me to play. Ah, beautiful. And so here is where the demo probably begins. Welcome to the City of the Dead. Wait, 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 wait. Is there anything around here I can probably get? Like a, a herb. I've been bitten. I don't have bullets. I mean, this is just a fantastic start. It's even better, I'd say, than in the actual demo. Because the demo gave me bullets. It, it gave me a little bit of everything here. I don't know. There's nothing here. Alright, let's see what happens. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> Beautiful. This is where it all starts. And this is where it momentarily ended when I didn't reach the liquors. Hello? Is anybody here? I don't think so, man. I don't think so. Okay, so. Give me the bullets. That's not a lot of bullets, but I'll, I'll, I'll take it. Will I ever need that key again? I don't know. Let's reload. Perfect. Let's finally save, because I really wanted to save while I was fast. Four. Uh, I got storage, sure. I got my deluxe weapons here too, but can't do anything with them just yet. Pretty cool. Let's put you away. I don't need you. Perfect. All right. I know this the laptop is where we continue the story-ish. Let's first take a look around. Things I didn't see or do before. I know I know I need the young knife for this. Matilda is a 12 shot capacity, 9mm polymer frame handgun. I know, I know, it's not that. We need a a spade key? Hmm. This is for the exit for whenever we find the three medallions, which I never found. So I don't actually know where they are. Um, let's see if there's anything else. Oh, hello. Ah, did I actually miss this the first time? That's good. Perfect. I know I also gotta go that way where it says keep out, because, you know, Leon's a rebel. He likes to go in places that he doesn't need to be. Freaking Raccoon City. Freeze, copper! Hmm, we've got plenty of things here, actually. Let me look around before we get going. What's, what's this? I don't know. I, I wish I did, though. Hmm, alright, cool. Let's check out what's up here, and then leave. For the actual area. Ah, more spade. Wonderful. Wonderful. Bullets! I knew it was a good reason to come up here. And, of course, I'm going to reload right away. At least I've got almost a full magazine. Leon, I don't mean to insult you, man, but you really are not running like a person who's in danger. You're running like a cop. Like a rookie cop. I know, it's, it's kind of sad. Not meant as an insult, though. Can I go in here? Whoa! That's cool. Didn't even know I could. There's nothing here, though. Alright. Ah, but let's see what's in here. Pardon? Heard something on the roof. Oh, wait. My own footsteps. Duh. Ah. A green herb. I'll just put that over here. Ooh, can I get some Mountain Dew? No? Maybe some Coke? No? Nah? Dang. That's cool, it's cool. Ah, more of this. 
guide pamphlet travel. Alright. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know, while we are the home of pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. There's the police station. The building in the center of town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be an art museum. Various features like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall remind us of a bygone era. Oh, so that's the museum's fault. Wonderful. Orphanage. Just a few blocks from the police station is an orphanage founded and run by the Umbrella Corporation with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from around the world. Oh, this is just a big foreshadowing, isn't it? We're going to have to go to the orphanage, I think, maybe. And the stained glass will obviously attract all the zombies, so let, let's see, let's see. And that's it, perfect. And there's something in here. What do we have? A safe. Never mind. Let's just go and uh, continue the story, shall we? Okay. Yes, RPD. I know, I know. And it's at this point that I... There has to be someone here. Ah, there we go. I've been playing for about half an hour, and in the next 30 minutes, I'll be able to do more or less what I did in the frickin' demo. So, let's see. Not good, buddy. Nope. Get out. Break room. Yeah, oh yeah, the map. Oh, the map. Leon, I can't hear you very well. I'm gonna tweak your audio too, because this is ri getting ridiculous. Okay, I can't tweak the audio. It's at max already. Oh, point of interest. Oh, I should probably check the statue out and all that. I can't actually max it out. I mean, I can't do more, more than it already is, but... What is curious is that I can... Check this out. I can put the audio, instead of the remake style, to be like the original game style. And that's a nice touch, I think. But okay, let's move on and see if we can't not miss bullets. I mean, shots. Oh, Leon, you poor fool. We've already done this tango before, this horrible, horrible little dance. Luckily for me, since I already did it, and it was so recent, I kind of remember where to go and what to do. That being said, however, I'm going to take my sweet, sweet time and actually do things right this time. Okay. Starting with the bullets and ending with actually finding things, like looking around, seeing things, the pretty, pretty art, the, the beautiful textures, the, the everything. The fact that we actually need a fuse that we never found. But, you know, that's just something for another time, right? Yeah, we can't actually get in here. That's exactly as I remember it. Yep, again, all the nopes. Wait! This door was closed? But when I come back, it's open. It's not, and it's not only open, it's filled with a, a, a it's got a zombie in it. That's not, that's not good. That's not good. It's really not good. Uh, yeah, I know. It's that way, but it's also this way. No, it's actually this way. For the sole reason that... What are you? Wait, I, I seem to recall doing this already. Ha! That's right. Hey, sir. Don't you dare get up. I will kill you if you do. Right, let's reload and have a weird number of bullets on our hands. Why not? Honestly, who gives me 6, 5, and then 10, huh? I think it was that order. There's nothing else in here? Did I literally just come to turn on the lights? Guess I did. And this guy's gonna get up. I mean, I shot him the first time, but... No one says he's gonna stay down. Alrighty. 
This has got to be tense in tense moments. So let's try and hold things when I don't need, when I j absolutely need to, but not because I have to. Hmm. Ah, this is the path. Right. So what's this way? I don't think I ever checked. What if I did? Oh yeah, Leon and the women's bathroom. Leon, you pervert. I believe I told you the first time. Don't just waltz in. Ooh. Don't just waltz in, dude. Doesn't matter if there's spray. Are you kidding me that I can't stack them? Oh, that's not good. I'm gonna need to find storage and fast. Including the, uh, the bit with the locker room. Seriously, I wanted to get all those things, and I couldn't. That made me a little angry, so... We are gonna rectify everything in this playthrough. Everything and anything. Jesus. Indeed. And let me just... Wait, combine? Can't combine, silly. Alright. Open up! I Open I know this dude. Goddamn door! I know dude your but your entrails are gonna hang out either way so I don't see what the problem is hmm yeah also re gotta remind uh, remind myself to actually block the windows oh this one's actually locked I don't remember if I tried it but okay yeah yeah I got it I know I know this is where shit gets real. Like, really real. Censorship real. Were those bullets? I'm sorry, dude. I'm so sorry, dude. He did! He tried though. He really did. Like, he really did. Oh, wait. It wasn't bullets, it was a little journal thing with the. with the way out. And the. Oh, hello. Oh, we've got the symbols. Could I maybe open one of these things now? Ooh, got a statue one two three. Ah yes, I gotta try that when I get back to the um to the main hub. Of course, we have the symbols. And there was one turnstile thing. Okay, you're dead. Return to main hall. This is not a good idea, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Boom, boom, boom. Oh not again. Ugh. I am so sorry, sir. Stop and stay down. Stay down. No. Stay down. Dude, are you Damn it. Are you for real? Just stay down. Good lord. What the fuck, man? He's not he's still struggling? Oh no. I'm running out of bullets, guys. Shit! Like, for real. Like, for really real. Seriously, stop it. Guessing this guy's still alive. Enough. I don't wait to bullets, I know, but I said enough. Are you for real? Okay, these guys are indestructible. I'm just wasting my bullets at this point. Let's get out, man. Let's get out. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, okay, I died. I'm still alive? Oh, that's BS. Run, Leon, run! It's not worth it! We can come back for this area later! Run, Leon, run! Oh, come on. 
I decided to change fate, history, and all things because I didn't have the bullets. Dude, I shot you in the head. What kind of zombies don't die with shots to the head? Definitely not these. Jeez. You okay, man? Yeah, barely. Thanks. Marvin Brown. Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I, I couldn't. I couldn't. No, you couldn't. Well, you tried, though. You yeah. tried. I think I went with the safer option, actually, not wasting all of my bullets. Sure you did what you could, Leon. Considering I could have run all this time. Does anyone know what started this? I tried. I tried. Not a clue. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Literally. You know, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. I agree. I think we already had hey, this Lieutenant? conversation too, so. Hopefully, you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Bloody hands. This he might just be right. We can get you to hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just going to leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. Listen to the man. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I love a rookie, Leon. You can't take him. Stop. Young, young Leon is so... Smug. And don't make my it's mistake. beautiful. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. Will do. You take it out. I mean, won't do. Or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> you know, let's leave the dying man here, Leon, and go check out the things. Young... Knife. Now in my possession. Oh, of course you occupy space in the inventory. I forgot. Equip on the inventory screen to use. Hmm, alright. A button to steady. Right trigger to slash. Perfect. I'm just gonna put you in the opposite corner because it looks nice there. Wah! Wah! Oh wait, no, not that one. There we go. Wah! Wah! Alright. Right now, we are very close to dying, my friendly Leon man. Yes. I understand how this works. Let's just use this. Ah, it may have been a complete waste of my frickin' of, uh, you know, the, the spray, but I think it was worth it. Alright, so... Lion statue, hold on, I got the, uh, yeah, this thing. Lion statue was lion, uh, herb, and phoenix. So we got lion. Oh, there we go. Herb and phoenix. Beautiful. Lion medallion. I am not leaving you there. I don't have the space, sir. So, I'm going to just put you right where you need to be. Which would be over here. Oh, cool. That's a teaser and a half. Right. Yeah, but the passage isn't open yet. Are these my footsteps? No, those are his. Huh. Gotta love how the footsteps kind of lead me right to where I need to be. Alright, let's open this up. Do this real nice and calmly, real really well. Ah, oh, I can already feel this myself is not messing how up. I imagine my first day. Same Leon, same. I feel you, bro. But let's do this. I'll take that. Let's reload. I'll take this. Can we actually stack them? Oh, that was not a good idea. Okay. Whatever. 
I, I, it's been a long time since I last played, uh, wow, that is very nice. Didn't actually think there'd be anything, any view from the inside out. It's been such a long time since I last played a Resident Evil man that I don't, I, I, I remember things, but I don't remember things. You feel me? Like, I know, I know, you don't combine herbs like that unless you're crazy, but, well, here I am, kind of crazy. Right, there was nothing here, nothing there. That zombo's gonna get up. And let's not forget the liquors and the zombie faces and the. Why? Leon, why? Why would you touch him? I still love the way it looks. I mean, it's a pretty gruesome effect. You should never, never touch a zombie in the face. What happened to this guy? Like, seriously. Someone had to have grabbed him, impaled him on that pipe, and then left him there. Assuming it was a giant, and this guy was a zombie, because otherwise, I don't know how you do that, dude. Oh. Confiscated item storage. The key is le... Clover! Okay, gotta remember this, these things, honestly. Really? Wait, am I missing anything? I feel like I'm missing something, but okay. Ah. Ah. I'm spooked by my own shadows and the, and the flare of the flashlight. Yeah, see, shouldn't I have uh, things to block the window at this point? Thought I did last time. Oh, uh, wait. I think I know what happened. I missed it. The room with the with the one cop. I missed it completely. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, I know. How are we gonna do this? We're gonna smash first, then. I actually can't. All right. Whatever, man. Hurry up. Open. Do you want me to smash you first? So they just wait. I don't know. Yep, there we go. Alright, let's do this real nice and calmly, yeah? I turn around, you come at me. And that's the first bullet wasted. Ooh, whoa -ho -ho! That was beautiful. That was beautiful. Gotta get up now. This ain't Resident Evil 4, no. No, sir. No Las Plagas here. Alright, what do we got? Nothing. Cool, cool. Well, let's do this real nice and slow. We have all the time in the world now. Ah, bullets. Lovely bullets. If I can just keep that kind of aim up the entire game, I'll be good. I'll be golden. Record of events. Oh yeah, I actually already read this. Mob attack, mob, 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 mob. I, I don't want to read this again. If you want me to read it, just put the demo. At least that one. Like I don't mind reading the new stuff, but the demo. This was a map of the police station. Which is very good because I need to know it. The, the safety deposit room is where I'm headed next. Then the dark room, which I never did anything there. West office was locked. I kind of remember that. And then we go upstairs where that's where I ended because I was running and I didn't really pay attention to anything anymore. Uh, but first, anything here? No, no, no. Can I actually get up through here? Yes, 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 maybe. No, no, no. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's go, Leon. Leon, buddy. Buddy, Loy. Buddy, boy. Buddy, Leon. All right, let's... Aim with the precision of something else. That's it. Oh, oh, yes. Using this distance to cover everything. It's beautiful. You got bullets, man? Excellent. Now we're talking. No, if seriously, if this guy gets up, I'm going to quit the game because they should not be getting up. Not with their heads blown off like that. 
Wait, this is... is It is the same door, okay. Dude, I know you wanted a snack or a coffee or something, but that's not the way you ask for it. You say it with a pretty please. Officers, man. These days, they're just... They're not, not, they're not kind, they're not good. West office. I, I never went in here, actually. So let's, uh, let's, let's, let's first go in here. Get the shotgun. My beautiful baby shotgun. Okay. And of course, this was the one that says that we're missing keys and we need to find some spare keys. Beautiful. I think 109 was one of the ones I could open. No, yeah, yeah. 109. There you go. Bullets. For the others, I do need to find the spare key, but that's fine. 102, 103. Oh, I could have probably also open 106. That's right, that's right. Let's open it while we're here. You could just press a little button without the keys, though, right? Oh, yeah. I remember getting this. I think this was gunpowder or film. Roll film. Is this so I can save, or is there, or is there something more, some actual reason this needs to be here? Because I don't actually know the answer to that. Let's just grab the ammo. The music is starting to ramp up again. That means the zombies are near me, and they know I got the shotgun, even though I don't have it yet. I need this. I do. I really do. But I also need this. 208. Ah, oh, man. Where's those keys when you need them? For now... Wait. Where's the... I didn't... Oh, no. They didn't give me the, the actual ID card. Or I completely missed it. Oh, no. Can I shoot the door? Would that be a prudent idea? Let's just wait. Boom. Oh, no. Come on. Boom. Fuck you. <laughs> nice, Leon. Boom. One more? One more? You want more? Good. I guess he doesn't want more. No way you're down. Huh. Where's the freaking ID? You can't do me like this game. Oh, hello. Gunpowder. I guess I need this. Uses of gunpowder. Okay. Handgun ammo. Gunpowder times two. Good to know. Shotgun shells. Gunpowder plus high-grade gunpowder. Yellow. Okay. Mag ammo. That must be for a submachine gun, probably. High-grade gunpowder times two. All right. There's not a lot of ammo left around the station, so make good use of any gunpowder you find. Different guns require different ammo, so pay attention when you're combining things or you won't get what you need. Yeah. I, I know what you mean, game. I just combined two green herbs like an idiot. Like as if I've never played this before. Where are you? Oh, cool. Jojo! Is this a reference? Blood. This can't be good. You don't want to step in there, Leon. Not just yet. Let's first uh, read this. Operations report. September 28th, 2.30 a.m. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel under this place left over from its museum days. I brushed her idea off before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof there's even a tunnel or that the sewers aren't infested with zombies. Someone who knows the word! Excellent! But I don't want to sit here and wait to die, either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try to find out what I can about that tunnel. You do that. You do that. Um, let's see. Oh, hello. Another rookie's first assignment. Me? Huh? We're putting you in a very special case. Your mission is to unlock your desk. <laughs> the 
The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Input the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. I, Of our first names. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names. Great. Well, you figured that much out, right, Leon? Good luck. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Scrawled in a corner between drips of drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. Oh, great. W so wait, uh, what? Welcome, Lee. Oh, this is just tragic. How do I know who sat where? Jojo? No, no, there, there's no one else here. I mean... Oh, fucking hell! Ow, my hand! You bastard. Jesus, don't do that. You bastard. Stay a down. Ow! Hit my hand against the desk. I didn't expect that, you freak. Oh, jeez. Not even bullets lying around. Okay, okay. Wait, do I have anything in my documents to actually tell me what I need to know? I wonder. What the? Where? I hear ya. Don't smell ya, though. Are you the one over there? Aha, I knew that I couldn't go in just yet. Come on. Walk less funny, dude. Boom. Uh-oh. Come on. There you go. Stay down. You got a bullet in your freaking temple. Seriously, stay down. Okay. What are we looking for? Another safe. I don't know the combinations to these things. Hmm. Hold on, let me just check the documents. There's gotta be something here. Officer's notebook. Oh, I'm glad I can scribble through this like this. That's awesome. Guide pamphlet, record of events. Hmm. David Ford. I don't even know who... Who's who at this point, so... Yeah. David Elliot. The initials of our first names. Branaha, Branag, whatever. Hmm. No clue. Oh, wait, here we go. Neil Carlson, Elliot Edward, N E something, wait, N E D. And on this side, M R M R. Oh boy, we're missing one. That's not good. Hmm. All right. For now, let's try the combinations. Okay. N E D. Right. Perfect. Ned. First break in. Ha. Nice. And the second one has to be okay, let's let's see if we can't figure it out. Marvin, Rita, and Jojo. Most likely. Aha, here we go. Marvin, Rita, and George. M R G. Perfect. M are, and they were really next to each other, so if you knew what to look for, you could have probably guessed. High capacity mag. Okay, that. Can I combine you? Beautiful. Matilda, you're looking more beautiful every day. I didn't even know you could customize weapons. Oh, dude, come on. You know, you could customize weapons in, in this game. That's cool. Son of a bitch. Stay down. Christ. 
What part about stick down don't you get it, man? You had like five bullets in your head, you took another five. This game is gonna get the better of me though. Ah, good to know. One thing I love about horror games, or that I've come to know that I love about them, is the beauty of them, you could say. Because I, I think the reason why I get scared, why people get scared, why especially YouTubers who are used to playing horror games can easily still get scared in games like these, is because of the immersion factor. Ah, that's what I'm looking for. Also you, but not yet. Hmm. But yeah, the immersion factor. Oh yeah, blue herbs treat poisoning. Okay. Oh, this is just like the blue, yellow, and red in Resident Evil 4. I could read that now, but I'm not gonna. Ooh. The immersion factor. The more immersed you are in a game, the more you will feel like you can actually... How do I put this? The more you will feel like you're part of the game. So along comes Resident Evil and... Ah, perfect. I should probably save in different files, but for now, for the first playthrough, it's fine. Oh, is this... Perfect! Just what I wanted to see. A key item. Can I store it with another key item? Yes, I can. Hope I don't need it soon, though. I could just store these two for now. As well as this. Got my green green, so that's pretty good. The more immersed you are in a game, the more you'll feel like you're part of it. And a, a big part of what helps with that is the lighting, the atmosphere, everything about the game. So, for example, this game, Resident Evil, the remake, is doing a really good job of showing you how to be scared, basically, or, or something like that. Film contains evidence, do not leave out. The same film I have here with me? Let's use it. Oh, that's right, I did do this before. I can remember the photo. And I think I should be paying attention to this thing. Scepter and a book. Okay. So this game, with its atmosphere, its terrifying visuals, and, and the just the feeling of horror that comes from trying to survive, evokes a perfect feeling, you might say. This is what I was looking for. Excellent. I'm just gonna take this. We're gonna need it. I can stack those, that's good. Shut up. Though I know what you're gonna do, so... You know what? Let's... Let's do it. I survived this thing last time, so... Let's do it. Real quick now. Real quick. Come on, buddy. Real quick, I said. God damn it. Yeah, I know. There we go. Get off. Beautiful. A few bullets wasted, but that's fine. What? What the? Oh, dude, no. Alright, round two then. You should fall down the stairs, I think, but that's fine. Fucking hell. And stay down. You're probably gonna see me jump way more than once, though. <sighs> Let's take it calmly, Leon. No need to rush. That's a very cool painting. We got boats? Yes, we do. Alright. This is very nice. I seem to recall that I had to go upstairs, because I couldn't do anything here. But we have a restroom, and there's got to be something in here, so... Oh yeah, this path. Couldn't do anything with, without the wheel. Let's check out the... Oh, whoa! 
fucking hell. Don't do that. Is he alive? And by alive I do mean, is he a zombie? Oh jeez. Please, not another one. Oh good. I don't actually have a shotgun, so I guess this is good. Well, this is the biggest disappointment ever. What do we got? Portable safe? Uh? You can examine an item, okay, yeah. That's not what I wanted to open. A small portable safe. I mean, sure. Can I even? Wait. I have no idea. <laughs> That's awesome, though. What did it say over here? Portable safe instructions. Press a button to light up its corresponding lamp. Light them all to open the safe. The buttons must be pressed in a certain order. Pressing a single button out of order will cause all the lights to go out, and you will need to start the sequence over again. Well, there's nothing around here that indicates the exact order, so... Unless there's this, which it's not. So... You know me. I'm gonna do this until I get it. There we go, that's one. That's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. And that's six. <laughs> Beautiful. Spare part. I can't actually spin it, can I? Maybe I can examine it? Hmm. Oh, wait! This is a button! There's nothing written on it, but it works as what I need it to, right? Hmm. I guess the real question is what do I want now? Let's quickly go and get that. Oh, come the fuck on, dude. Oh, God! Stay down! Get out! And away. Give me my knife. Christ. This is gonna be a tough game. Especially if these guys just pop out of nowhere. Let me guess, this guy's alive, isn't he? Stay down. Are you freaking kidding me? Good god. Should probably aim for the head more. Just to see if we can't help these guys out. Okay, we definitely need the two. Oh, come on. Where are ya? Son of a bitch. There we go. That's all I needed. Okay. So. Yeah, we definitely need the two to get the... A couple of things, actually. Just the shotgun shells and this thing, which I think is extra storage. So let's go. Put it in there. Use. I'm glad I can choose, actually. Good. Alright, so. 208. And... I think the other one was actually 203 or 202. Let's try it. Nope. Was it actually 203? I mean, that's gonna suck if. Oh my god, it was. Alright, whatever. That's good enough. Do we have access to anything else? Ooh, wait. 102. Hmm, I need that. Gunpowder, perfect. 
Ooh, an extra knife. I could use that. But, okay, one thing at a time. Let's just pick this up. Alright. Now I know I should be going upstairs. And I should probably just first save up my things. Like over here, because I got some extra gunpowder. I don't actually have any bullets. I may just save them up for now, but anyway. Uh, having done these things, I have to end it here. I know, shocker, I did, I did even less than the actual demo, but it's beautiful because now we actually have a way to keep going. And for the next episode, we are definitely heading upstairs and finding those liquors and just doing everything that we didn't do and more. Especially finding the ID. I need that. But for now, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, thumb wrestle with that like button down below. Comment and subscribe. But as always, I'm the only me, so you be the only you. See you next time.